world's fastest boosted board. I made a video about my boosted speed hack back in July when I was like 15 pounds heavier. And there were some comments, people saying the battery would fry, the motors would fry. Nah. If you're new around here, my name is Sam Sheffer. I make videos about tech and I am a seasoned boosted board rider. I would consider myself an expert. I've got 3,000 miles on that V2 alone. And I would say probably at least 500 of those miles are with the big wheels. And in case you haven't seen the original speed hack video, that'll be linked below. But these are BOA 100 millimeter wheels. And yes, they make the board heavier. Yes, they take a toll on acceleration and battery life, but I like to go as fast as possible. And I've hit 28 on this boosted board. I know my video, I said 27. Um, I use Waze on my iPhone to capture the top speed. Now that is up for debate whether or not that is super accurate, but seriously, find me a boosted board that goes faster than this. We're gonna go outside and ride. I just have to caveat this video by saying it's pretty windy outside and the wind really works against you when you're trying to go fast. With the nature of Manhattan, it's there's always so much traffic and whatnot here and the roads aren't fantastic, but I'm gonna try and find a good straightaway and open up ways on my phone and show you just how fast I'm going. And then you can see what it's like in traffic as well. Savage good though. And just anecdotally, I think the speed limit in Manhattan is 25, so. Yeah, that's uh that's 28 miles an hour. No software modifications, literally just swap the wheels. I did swap the bearings too, so there's relatively new bearings. At this point, they're not new anymore, but when I put the wheels in here in July, I got new bearings, and yeah, the board goes 28 miles an hour. And I've emphasized this in other videos before, but just the few mile an hour difference between, you know, top suit of regular boosted board 22 or the Stealth 24 versus 27, 28, it's good. So with all of that said, if you have a boosted board that can do flat ground faster than 28 miles an hour, leave me a comment and I'd love to race.